Hey there guys, Weenio here. So I know this isn't really a, uh, it's not exactly an LP, but then again, nor is it a vlog. It's, uh, you know what time it is. Yep, time to start voting again. Vote for the next weekend LP, uh, considering we just finished up, um, Diablo 3. <laughs> wow, took me that long. I actually had to think about that. That's insane. But, well, I beat it a long time ago, so I just got around to uploading it. Never mind, you get the point. Anyways, all awkwardness aside, it's time to start voting for the next LP. And um, so I've compiled a list of four games. Uh, one of them is blind, the other three are not. Uh, but um, I tried to pick uh, generally games that, um, <laughs> stop saying um, that are short so that I can easily complete them in the time of a weekend and n or <laughs> not in one weekend but that you know releasing them every weekend would feel like a good idea or feel like a fast enough pace and I'm not sure yet whether or not I'm gonna be uploading two of these episodes every day or if I'm gonna release like one episode of this a day on the weekends with, like, say, a Fallout episode or a Banjo-Kazooie episode, just in case you guys still want to see that, so you don't have to, like, leave YouTube for a weekend and have nothing that you want to watch coming out of me. Ew. But anyways, so, um, first game we're going to talk about on this list uh, is Half-Life 2. Half-Life 2 is probably the longest game on this list, uh, and even then, you know, I'm pretty confident I could beat this and uh, like literally I don't know <laughs> I honestly have no idea where I was going with that I have a feeling I could beat it a lot faster than I think I can but um who knows you know Half-Life 2 has been in a lot of these voting things but it's never really gotten picked um I have a big urge to play it recently but uh you know it's not really one that has to be done and I know you guys are probably gonna comment saying like do what you want to do but you know I like to give you guys a little bit of choice here so Half-Life 2 is your first game um, will probably be the longest one on this list uh, even still um, you have to keep in mind for all these voting decisions that we have an LP a week LP that's ending soon called Fallout 3 uh, and once Fallout 3 ends, this weekend LP is going to become the new week LP. So just keep that in mind. So Half-Life 2, if you're afraid that like it won't go fast enough, uh, just wait. Because once Fallout ends, then it's going to go f quicker than shit. But um, anyway, moving on to the next game of your choosing. We have Serious Sam HD, first encounter. The first of the... Uh, four Serious Sam games that I would think about playing. Um, uh, a prerequisite for all these games is that if they have a sequel, just keep note that the uh, that this probably means that's going to lead into more sequels. So like next time I'll be saying like Serious Sam HD the second encounter, then I'll be saying like Serious Sam 2 and then Serious Sam 3. Um, this game is relatively short, a lot shorter than Half-Life. Uh, I could beat it fairly quickly. The only problem is there's a lot of secrets and a lot of stuff to show in this game. And I'm not 100% sure if I'll be showing all of that, but I would like to for, you know, completionist sake. But I don't know. Uh, we'll see, but once again, it's another option that's just thrown out there. Uh, but yeah, just keep that in mind. Next one on our list is Bioshock. Uh, Bioshock would eventually lead to Bioshock 2, and when it comes out, eventually lead to Bioshock Infinite, which um, is pr I'm pretty excited for. But uh, Bioshock, it's generally a short game. If anything, this is the game that's competing with Half-Life for longest game, because, I don't know, it's, you know, it's up to you, really, the player. <laughs> but um, the thing about Bioshock is that... Uh, I feel like it's a lot shorter than I think it is. I feel like there's a lot that I've forgotten about it. And then when I play it, I'm going to be like, oh, son of a bitch. And it's going to turn out to be a longer OP than I wanted. But you never know. Uh, Bioshock's really fun. 
if I played this, I probably wouldn't be able to hold my self back from uh, getting all giddy and excited for playing Bioshock 2. Because, I don't know, I think Bioshock 2 is better, but eh, if you've seen my top 100 or something games list and you've heard my rant about Bioshock and Bioshock 2, I don't think neither one is better than the other. But if it had to come down to it, I'd say Bioshock 2 is better than Bioshock. But uh, never mind. Now I'm getting into stuff that shouldn't be on here. And now for the grand finale. Your blind game would be Bastion. Bastion is a game that gets praised a lot in the indie community. And my friends talk about it constantly. Like almost nonstop. Well, not really. They talk about other things nonstop, like Pokemon and how big their buttholes are. But then again, that's just the type of people I hang out with. Uh, but anyway, <laughs> um, Bastion, it's a game that a lot of my friends and people have been telling me to play for quite some time. I've always just never played it, you know. And I bought it during the uh, during the summer sale for Steam this year. And I was like, you know what? One of these days, I will play through you, Bastion. And um, from what I hear, it's relatively short. I could easily keep it as a weekend LP. And if it ever, and if it ever made it to, um, you know, uh, a full week LP, then I'm pretty sure it'd go by really fast. But uh, another game that I'm excited to play, but then again, it's blind, so you never know. Um, I have a <laughs> weird feeling that this one's going to win. But I don't know. Um, sadly, why I'm picking a lot of, like, these short, uh, like, abstract games in this list, well, because <laughs> you know Half-Life 2 and Bioshock are totally abstract, but, um, why I'm picking a lot of the games on this list is, like I said, because of how relatively long they are. That was an awkward-ass cut, but, um, yeah, you know, uh, leave a comment on whichever one you think you want. Um, note that even though a few of these have like Xbox logos on the top, all of these would be played on PC. Don't get it confused with like me being on Xbox, like rocking some Bastion. Nope, not going to happen. All this stuff would be played on PC. But uh, yeah. Um, if uh, there's no games here that really interest you or like pique your curiosity, Wait until uh, Fallout's done, and then we'll be picking a new week LP, depending on uh, how long said game that you pick right now is going to be. Because then we're going to be going into choosing a new week LP, and that's when shit gets intense, because then we're going to be seeing a lot of games, and a lot of like longer games in there. But, you know, this is what you got to work with for now. Uh, I'm kind of going, I'm choosing the middleman, whereas you guys say, play what you want to play, but I'm kind of like, I want you guys to choose. Well, here's the middleman. I pick games, you guys choose from those games. Now, I will see you next time. Uh, they're probably, you know what? Fuck it. You guys are getting a Fallout 3 episode today. How do you like it? Um, Fallout 3 will be uploaded later tonight. Uh, be sure to check that out. Yada, yada, yada. This doesn't count as a vlog, so I'm not going to talk about any of that. I will put up a vlog tomorrow, and hopefully the uh, first episode of whatever this is. You don't know. Uh, I'm going to keep... This voting is going until uh, Friday the 14th. That's super convenient. It's one day away from the 13th, but, you know. Uh, so Friday the 14th is when this voting ends, so... Get your shit in gear, kid, and choose.